Time now for a segment brought to you by Palm Wonderful, Wonderful Pistachios, Nate's Honey Company. We've reached the Friday before Mother's Day and we are ready to celebrate. Registered dietitian and chef Abby Gelman joins us now with some delicious recipes that are perfect to help usher in spring and celebrate Mother's Day. Good morning, Abby. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? It's good to have you with us. Thanks, I'm so glad to be here. So you're ready to celebrate spring as we all are and Mother's Day weekend with brunch. Um, tell us why pomegranate juice is so good for you. Absolutely. So I have over here a strawberry pomegranate spritzer and I always have Palm Wonderful 100% pomegranate juice at home because it is no added sugar, no fillers, no preservatives, and it's just goodness full of antioxidants, there was actually a UCLA in vitro study um, that showed that there is more per serving antioxidants in this pomegranate juice compared to green tea, red wine, and grape juice. So that's a, a bonus, right? Absolutely, and it is really, really so, so good. And then, I mean, we were talking before how much I love those wonderful pistachios <laughs> that are in front of you, but I could sit down Crack open one of those bags and go through the whole bag without a problem. My favorite is are the ones, is it the chili ones in the red bag? I think those are my favorite. Oh yeah, the chili ones uh, right here. And you I should mix them. the chili with the honey roasted and get like a sweet, spicy. Oh, oh it's so good. I didn't even think of that. <laughs> yeah, there's your tip. Yeah. So, so, um, well, I love pistachios also as well. So just one serving of wonderful pistachios gives you six grams of plant-based protein and three grams of fiber. So you get healthy fat, fiber, plant-based protein, which is always a great way to fill you up in a healthy way. Um, so I've used it in some more brunch recipes here. I've got some carrot cilantro slaw with some toasted pistachios mixed in there. And over here, I've got roasted asparagus and I made a lemon pistachio gremolata, which is essentially parsley and pistachios and lemon all mixed together and put on top. And then of course, always I, I have, you know, in shell or no shells out for guests to enjoy or just for me and my family to enjoy for snacking. They look really, really good. Such, such great stuff. Um, now, one of the other things, how about some, uh, some dessert? We need a little dessert too. Yeah. Ooh, dessert's always one of my favorites, right? So I have these, mini um not bite size but individual portion size they're no bake cheesecakes Ooh. and i used they're so good i used um nature's nates organic raw unfiltered honey and they also have these wonderful little mini packets that you can have on the go you can bring them to work or school or wherever um, but then of course they also have these larger sizes and it's a really nice complex and nuanced flavor in Nate's organic honey and that's the only sweetener I used in this cheesecake so there you go and honey is really good too for for people I know who have allergies uh, this time of year suffering yeah. you kind of build up build up that uh, you know immunity to some of the pollen that's in the air as well yeah absolutely it's great all around honey dessert um, in tea, you can drizzle some on top of these little mini cheesecakes as well. Oh, so I'm gonna have so some, many. So I'm going to have some cheesecake. I'm going to have some pistachios. And I'm going to have a, a great drink while I'm at it. Thanks so much for being with us. Yeah. Sure. Thanks for having me. This segment was brought to you by Palm Wonderful, Wonderful Pistachios, Delicious Nate's uh, Honey Company. Great ideas. And if you missed any, don't worry. You can get the recipes on roadshow.com.